Look there, warriors of the Empire. I am Yusril, the game is Star Trek Online, and welcome to Foundry Frolics. And unfortunately, Riser, the war is officially over, more's the pity. And we have been invited to enjoy, well, the debauchery, the sun, the sand, the sea, the peace. And even the Risens can build a decent warship, so perhaps they're not quite as gentle as they're making out to be. Still, if this is your thing, you are welcome to indulge yourself for another month or so. But if it isn't, if the call to battle sings in your veins, we have a mission to attend to. We are going to be playing the follow-up to Honor of Farasa. I did this a few months back. I will leave an annotation somewhere in this video if you want to see that. And having dealt with the mangy felines, we are going on to Honor of Orions. We are to be called back to Kronos at the request of Ambassador Satas. Has it cleared? Who knows? I hope not, for that would imply peace. Diplomacy. As it is, we're going to a glowing door in the red light district. Let's see, the events have been reviewed, the Patriarch has sent an ambassador to discuss the matter discreetly, and he won't say any more on an open channel. Well, that could be sensible. And they're going off some entertainment in Kuvbel. Well, let's see how badly they've been ambushed. Yeah. Then again, I suppose there are probably some Klingons who might go for that kind of thing. Probably even give them to it free of charge for the novelty. Ambassadors. Diplomats. Bah. Transwarp, give me Kronos. A fully armed and operational heavy battle cruiser. A top of the line crew, especially if you keep them in shape with the odd execution. And here we are, nurse maiding ambassadors round the first city's flesh pots. Oh, Satas. Satas is honourable, I will give him that. But we'll see if this cat can match him. I will not be surprised, but I'm probably going to get disappointed. And what do you want, Grim? Still skulking about, hoping Quark doesn't catch you, I imagine. Right. The challenge floor. Put your backs into it. Start trying to actually kill each other like proper warriors. Do you even know how to use Bathless? Those aren't some Federation training sticks you're working with. Those are proper warriors' weapons. Ugh, this new generation. They're going soft, I tell you. Just swinging at each other. How long have they been doing that now? Weeks? Months? Club Kuvbel. Let us steal ourselves for the debauchery out of my way. I have a mission. I'm on the business of the Empire. Club Kuvbel. Looks like they repurposed half a dozen hull plates for that. You wish, you wish me to queue. Bah! A Klingon warrior does not queue. What do you want? No cutting in line. Yes, I'm cutting in line. Excellent. And the boss can stay with me. We are here on business, not pleasure. Your hollow projectors are malfunctioning. Which is probably good. At least you don't have to pay holographic stuff. Right, where are you? Where are you? Ambassador! You, well, I suppose at least you're kind of sticking to your species with the kitty. Get on with it. Ambassador, the, I said I could meet you here. Yes, I'm here on business. What else did you think? Right. Enjoy myself around the club. Can I start a fight? I have no idea. Well, I'm probably not going to enjoy myself then. Let's get on with it. What do I have to do? Join the dance party, toast the couple and get a drink from the bar. I want your largest, largest bottle of prune juice. If nothing else, we can close this place down. What is so funny, barkeep? Excellent. You get to keep your head. 
Alright. When next? Clearly he can't hold his prune juice. You carry him out of here. If you manage to see straight. When next? Toast the couple. Excellent. Well, that's the... This is actually the poker game. Let's see what we've got. Excellent. Good luck against those Romulans. Here's a hint. They'll be cheating. And we need to toast the couple. Where is the couple? I have no idea. Ah, there you are. Congratulations. May your offspring be an interesting furry mix of genetic incompatibility. Fur or scales? I have no clue. I dare say we'll find out. Maybe. And finally, the dance party. Indeed, it is highly dishonourable, so what are you doing off your ship? Get out of here, as I will shortly be following you. Dance. Ah. Is this over? Can I stop yet? Good, thank you, excellent. Satas, now that you're done with the ritual humiliation, can we kill something? Bah. Well, I suppose at least you can be excused if you had to spend six months in quarks. Alright, Rafeo, do I know him? Bah, nope, do I care? Why was I summoned? Oh, terrific. Who did you let escape? Bah. Right. No, they're not dead. They're not the main force. The Nimbus Sector, terrific. And the Patriarch was just a figurehead. Of course they just elected another Patriarch, didn't they? Humph. So who's the new Patriarch? Roy Sec. Uh, huh. So what's the plan? Dangerous, much more so eugenics, blah blah blah. Dishonourable scum, blah blah. Kill, kill, main burn. Excellent. Strange occurrences. Uh, huh. And he's arming the Jegpri. Really? Well, in that case, it is going to have to be a slow, painful, and excruciating death. Um, do you want the Empire to collapse and the Gorn be free? Bah. Well, at least you're honest about it. Hm. Right. The chassis did destroy the ship and the Syndicate has been quiet. In other words, the... Syndicate didn't care when she died. Right, key convoy is leaving with the war with the Voth, and we're on escort. Oh, you've lost the convoy. Why didn't you call me in three days ago? Bah. Okay, oh, and he's running things. And um, Worf's running the background. You worry too much about it. Give me danger. Give me bloodshed. Kapla! Right, really? Okay, so she's the plant. Of course she's a plant. Even if she wasn't actively spying for them, hey, they were Orions, and information's a commodity. They're as bad as Ferengi in that regard. Right, we're done. And as reward for your cooperation, I will not be burning your club to the ground when I get back. Private line, House of Jumpok. Okay. Indeed, it does sound like a glorious battle. Let's get on with it. They made a stop in the Maraid system, and then you're going to start kicking over cans and blowing the gaff here to the Maraid system. Beam us up now. Welcome to the Maraid. Archer's station is directly ahead. Lay a course, and we will... Blech, Romulan architecture. Where's the spikes? Where's the armor plating? What's wrong with good old fashioned Cleon options? Ah, uh, a Romulan. Terrific. Archer Station of the Romulan Republic. You'd think they'd have renamed it, wouldn't you? Kapla, transmitting codes. Attache, we're tracking a convoy. Where did it go? They had severe issues. Terrific. And they altered course. Why didn't they just come back here for spare parts? You have a replica. Uh, ha! Ha! You will take care of your own pest problem. I suggest flamethrowers. The Empire appreciates your assistance. I may even lend you a flamethrower. 
Although, to be perfectly frank, if you're going to name your ship after a beast of burden, then uh, perhaps I should not be surprised that you have a treble problem. Next stop, the Nav Beacon. And incoming ambush in 10 kilometers. Dump down. Are the Breen about to go hostile? Do I care? Ah, uh, ha! Of course they are. Patach! I have no interest in your data. Really? You want to play? Fine, let's play. Break away. You want to play with tractor beams? Fine, it's not going to help you very much. There we go, break the range, pop in a barrier, and loop round. Talk to spread, attack skills armed, and you will learn what it means to fire on a ship of the Empire. Have it all, have every weapon. Weapons! I need more weapons! What is wrong with you? All over again, get the forward cannons to bear. Run the teams, and boom, there goes your cruiser. Brace for impact. Come on, give me the boom, there we go. There's always a boom. Next problem, three miserable frigates who like their tractor beams far too much. Open the range, turret fires pretty much disposed of one of them anyway. And evasive maneuvers, line up the run, hard over, and back into range. Cut the throttle, and have a well-deserved death. Burn in Grethor, you miserable patak! You refrigerated drones. Not so good when your enemy can shoot back, are you? Stick to harassing miners, it's all you're good for. Bah. Played by the Dominion. Mercenary scum. No more Breen ships. Move us to optimal departure angle. Navigation, do you have my core solution yet? And if not, start updating your will. Excellent. Engage! I will be in my red room, apparently, with my entire bridge staff. Let's see what they have to say on the matter. And here we are, the ready room, nice and secure. Ah, uh, Pet Mastiff, what have you been doing? Okay, Pet the Mastiff. Indeed, Kapla, Kapla. He's proved excellent for motivating junior officers aboard ship. It also keeps him fed. As you can see, he has grown quite handily since that mission on Aurora Pente. Now, library computer. Orion Syndicate entry. Uh, have right. Check for library computer on Ferraris and ships and tactics. Right, where do we need to go? High Council members. Aha. Uh -huh. Main menu, where is it, where is it, where is it? Milani Dion, current status unknown. Right. Where is my guide? Ah, review the Ferraris and database, it's over here. What do we need to know? Classified entries, ID, star, 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 pass, star, 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 star. This database may indeed bring me glory. You can tell me about the Clan Shiasi historical overview. Redacted Fegump. Fegump, hey. What's this related? 1200 years ago. Militarily strong, too revolutionary. Selective breeding, telepathy. Some of the clans up objected and there was a small oh no there wasn't a small war they destroyed the research laboratory after losing the debate what else do we have what's this about red flag and entry really can't intentions ever send mail uh -huh. it's the chef 
Great, my chef could have been poisoning me. Clan exile usually means death sentence, blah blah blah, supply list, blah blah. Uh huh. Person exile, temporary period of five years. Great, the chef could have been poisoning me. Terrific, on the other hand, at least he had been exiled from the chassis, so he probably hasn't. That said, I have a vacancy for a new chef. Just as soon as I finish killing the old one. Right. Eugenics program, yeah, we've got that. Log out. Right, contact the mess hall. What do we have? You can send the Beck up to my ready room. Well, she might return. The mess officer knows me. Uh, report to airlock to it once. It's tempting. Next time I will not be so lenient. Right, Beck, we need to talk. Also, my Mastiff is hungry. You may well prepare one last meal. Right, good. I need to know more about you. Uh, ha, the big celebratory purple eye. Yes, as I remember, you used the dinosaur's blood for it. Indeed, you cook well, Beck. Uh, did we even bother to ask about her heritage? I don't think we did. Your exile. Indeed. Clan Shiasi. Wait a minute, if she's 16... Oh, right, she's 14 in the cook. Well, she learned fast, didn't she? Uh, her, oh, right, for arson years, not KDF years. Ambassador? Oh, good. Perhaps it was a good thing we didn't throw her out of the airlock. You get to live. Right. But I could save you. That sounds like Satas. Uh, huh. Right, okay. Ambassador! Yes. A little bit of indiscretion. Right, so where do you stand on the old clan? He was exiled, refused to undergo genetic modification. Right, okay. And I don't imagine they would. Right, you're a member of this crew. Oh, uh, what's that bridge? Who did you let sneak up on us? We've been struck by debris from a frick. Why were you not looking where we were going? You can go and repaint the ship without a suit. We'll just beam you outside, let you explode. That should do the rest. It'll cover the stains quite nicely. Still, look on the bright side. At least the chef probably wasn't poisoning me. Set course, and then drop from warp once we're within range. And dump to impulse. Here we are, what's left of the convoy. We have got a few freighters, one wrecked Deridex. The IKS Chang. Another more class later ruin. Her captain must have been incompetent. And the Shiasi are using a Galore class. They must be short on hulls. And the USS Ranger is in attendance for some reason. What's going on here? Loop around and scan the convoy. Hmm. Federation Escorts. Was this a joint effort? Okay. Right. Battle alert! Indeed. Let us take out these honorless scum and get some answers. You wish to play with beam weapons. I have bigger guns than you do. Really? And you want to play with chanting as well. Beam up. Pop. Your plasma torpedoes, they do not work properly. In the meantime, break back. Loop around. Oh, it appears we've had the patience to wait. That's actually kind of clever on the part of the AI. Right, back around. Full up. And go again. Boom. Done. The Shiasi is destroyed, the Gallo is still disabled. Board them! Let's get some answers. And here we are, Cardassian Architect Epos. 
Epos. Here we go again indeed. Bring it on. Command, we have no option. Call in the barrage on my position. Fire everything. Indeed, these ta- Kick! What do you mean you think we beamed into the Astrometrics lab? Did you not bother to check? And why did we not just beam bomb onto their bridge? Never mind. What do we have? They have a base in the Azure Nebula. That makes sense. And let's get moving. We have a ship to purge. Although at this point we could just beam out and do it from Disruptor Fire. Hull the place as we go. Epos. Excellent. Some honest opposition. Come here, you honorless, miserable, mangy patach. You think you can rebel against the Empire? Where are your genetic enhancements now? What are you all shooting at? Trigger discipline, Beck. Mind it. Excellent. The Ambassador and the Zendaris have arrived, and they borrowed the Transwarp Gateway. Excellent. Yes, we know. We just killed some of them. And they beam some Gorn on board. Very well, let's go. Purge the Gorn. What is that? Okay. Wait. Ambassador. Yes, indeed. They would appear to be just standing there. No matter. Ambassador. It would appear that they were not just modifying Epos. Indeed. Sure, so you've been out there. There isn't really anything we can do. Ha! We need assistance. Maybe you tripped something. Uh -huh. Well, Satasa's got the right idea at last. I told you not to beam them aboard, but anyway, let's just purge the place. Aha! A Shiasi Nanov. I have no idea what these are capable of, and I don't care. Bring forth the shotguns, keep them contained. But yet, keep them dead. Are you done yet? Excellent. We will not be beaming over the 16 year old, no matter how many tentacles you've got. And it would appear that they couldn't keep control of their creations either. Can we activate the self destruct? Terrific. This may take a while. This is either the self destruct or chocolate cake, and let's face it, they're not going to go for chocolate cake on this bridge. Oh, terrific. Why didn't we just beam back and send over a dozen torpedoes? What have we got? More experimental subjects. A hyper-enhanced Nanov. I have no idea what this is. It's not going to be fun, I know that much. Stay away from it. Yeah, well. Come on, let's just keep it going. Freeze it. Let's see what we need to do. Right. I was like, of we have no option to a battle. Let us slay this thing in honourable combat. Or failing that, just call in the barrage and keep it in one place. And boom. Did that do the trick? Not quite. What heresy is this that it survived a strike from a ship disruptor? No matter. We will carve it up. Who's up for calamari? And apparently it also had a personal shield. I can only assume that belonged to its last meal. Where next? Return to the Astrometrics lab. An assault nanov, eh? Well, it can meet my turret. Come on then, you little scum. Let's see what you can manage. The answer would appear to be very, very little. Forwards. All oh, right, they're dead. Shoot them a few more times. They're still twitching. Back to the Astrometrics Lab. Good. Energize. Give me every torpedo you've got. And then find where I left my pulse wave. Excellent. They're hooked into the auto-destruct. 
Purge. Purge it all. Thank you. Why didn't we... Your point? Oh, no. No. Kill it. Purge it. Apparently I have to be stupid. Beam aboard the shuttle and then make sure that it stays quarantined. Excellent. So, we have a shuttle which will need to be purged. Ambassador, you are welcome to join us. Engage. I'm sure we could have given you a ride and some alone time with your daughter. Welcome to the Asia Nebula. Let's see what we need to do. And we're ready to scan for the chassis. Let's go wake them up. What have we got? Several possible power sources. Beck, what's your suggestion? Follow the most likely energy source. I'd like to know which is the most likely energy source. Humph. Okay. Right. This task did indeed teach her well. However, let's see what we need. Pick an energy signature and let's go. Of course, it's more than likely that the most likely energy signature is a trap. So, what's the second most likely energy signature? Of course, knowing that, you might well say, well, we'll set the trap at the second most likely energy signature, and then put our base at the most likely energy signature, and just go round and round in circles. Aha! Strike! Apparently the Farasans are either too clever or not clever enough. Hello, you miserable scum. The Empire has come... Oh, wait, no. We may have tripped a sensor alarm. Terrific. Well, let's go follow... Why didn't you say that straight off? Helm, follow that signal. Yeah, Ferrarsons. They may well be good at sneaking around like thieves in the night, but they will be no match for honest warriors. This is why they have had to resort to the blasphemy of genetic engineering. Get back here! Ah, uh, terrific. Right, evade away. Look round. And have some cannon. There we go, that's one. And two. Track that fleet. We can come back and purge this base. Oh, never mind, the base exploded as well. That's fine. Get after that fleet! They fled from one Klingon cruiser. Terrific. At least we don't have to worry about purging the Epos. What do you mean you've lost them? Ah, uh, great. One of those fleets is heading for Tejas Moor. Handy of them to decloak, isn't it? Corvat, Ganalda for Arcanes. Ugh, really. This is the Federation's doing. Those miserable... Miserable, little, insidious, terrorist Patakshai. They are not worthy of being Jegpui. Michaelis guide you, Satas. You'll need to hold the Empire together while we go and purge these lousy rebels. Their fate will be sung of by warriors and whispered by mothers to terrify disobedient children. It will be remembered a thousand generations hence as what happens to traitorous scum. Or to put a little more candy, I'm going to take them to the cleaners, pal. Finally, several Ganaldan vessels engaging with the Shiasi, right there up for execution as well. And we have to help the Orions. This is going to leave a bad taste in my mouth. At least when you're dealing with the Ferengi, you know they're on the scum. The Orions try to hide it. Fire everything! Purge, 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 purge the lousy traitors. Break away. 
get to range again, and then we will swing around and give them the Empire's latest torpedo as a demonstration of goodwill. Ah, oh, the Ganaldans, they have teleport tech. That's annoying. Still, at least they're nicely grouped up. Hard over, come on, give me range. Target, and... Fire! Reinforce the shields. Deal with the whole bleed through. And maintain fire on these Ganaldans. They've been nicking technology from the Alachi. Why am I not surprised that these miserable, miserable scum have sided with that bunch of vivisectionists? An aftermarket dreadnought, eh? Too poor to afford your own. Very well. Loop over. And we'll start with that cruiser first of all. Hard break. Get that virus out of my computers. Honestly, can't even handle a decent fight, so they have to resort to that kind of trickery and virus programming. Excellent. One last little cruiser to deal with. Boom. Right. Orions, you owe us yet again for saving your backsides. Start talking. And it's one of Milani Dion's flagships. Right, about time. Let's clear this up. Indeed, you. Well, 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 well. Apparently she can. Ha! Credit where you, I did look at her face. Very clever, you little... Humph. You gave them the Epos? Really? Grass has been a hard market to break in, so this was all about business. Ha! Well, well, well. They have more sense than some Klingons if they didn't let the women in. Alright, they needed supplies. And then they were going, but with them in exile... Yes. <laughs> Right, so the Syndicate's back online, and it will need to be resolved in front of the High Council. Excellent, we'll do this publicly. See you next time in honour of the Empire! The Orions are desperately trying to make up for their little misdemeanours. And we will finally get to purge the Shiasi. No doubt we'll discover that the Federation were behind those rebellions on Borderwell's peace bach. The undiscovered country indeed, from whose boom no warrior returns. Until next time, Kapla!